All right, so we have push-ups, a good old-fashioned push-up, all I like to call it a moving plank. It's just like a bench press where you want to keep your elbows stacked right over your wrist. Also, you want to make sure your elbows aren't chicken winging it out too far or close to your rib cage. The reason being is because if your elbows come out too far, then chances are your shoulders are going to roll forward, get a little bit too much trap. If your elbows come too close to your rib cage, then it's going to be, again, too much shoulder and too much tricep. We want to open up a little bit and become a little bit more vulnerable across the chest. So our elbows should be right about 45 degrees or somewhere, uh, whatever's comfortable. Also think about how would you punch a punching bag? You wouldn't punch it up here too much, you wouldn't punch it down here. That power is going to be right in the middle somewhere. I like to spread my fingers open quite a bit because it's going to allow me to get a little bit more torque and stability. Think of squat when we talk about external rotation. You still want to do the same thing with your shoulder. So I'm going to spread the earth on the way down and compress it inward on the way up. Keeping a nice neutral spine, so I gotta squeeze my abs, squeeze my glutes and my quads, so I have a nice straight line from my head to my heels. From here again, elbows right over my wrists, squeeze everything as strong as I can, start a nice neutral spine, lower down, come up, compress the ground inward as I go. Spread the earth apart, compress inward. Inhale on the way down, exhale on the way up. 